Boy's Diary on May 16. Drone fishing. Drone fishing is very unique. Using drone and then drone can carry the sink with the lines of, of bait and to the far of about 200 or 300 meters far away in the ocean. And then just click the button and the drone release the line and the lines go down, fall into the water and then sinking and then uh, the anglers can wait with the line and then when the fish on the hook and fish move, go away. And then the angler can feel the fish on. So, and then angler can pulling down uh, the line or reeling with the, with the reel. Uh, in the end, they can catch the fish. They can expect the big fish because uh, drone <laughs> can go far away uh, beyond the limit uh, distance when the angler casting with the fishing rod, uh, like a fishing rod about 60 meter or 70 meter is a maximum for people with the fishing rod. But the drone can carry it more than three times than normal catching fishing rod. So when drone fishing is a unit, so and then one of my club member and then bought the fishing drone. So and then we tested the drone. We expected the drone fishing soon. So to do drone fishing, we need bait. So I tried to catch the bait uh, with a bait can. So when I prepare the two the bait cans from the shop, I bought two bait cans. And then um, the bait cans made with the net and then the string, there's a hole. If the bait fishy swam into the bait can, the bait, the small fish, uh, cannot get out. So, and then uh, I can get uh, bait fish. So, for the bait fish, uh, we need some, another bait for bait fish. I use uh, the crab, two kinds of crab. One crab is uh, just, uh, uh, not cooked one, no, dead or live, and then just fresh. And I cut something and then and I put it into the uh, small um, mosquito net uh, or the sag of uh, onion. We, I use the sag of onions with the lead color in lead. And then and I put the crab, the the broken crab, small remains, and then the, with the rubber rubber strings, and then tied it. And the other is a hooked one. So I want to check out which one is good for bait attraction. So and then and I we go we went to the the bait spot to catch the bait. And then uh, we took a film and drone film because we are going to make a documentary with the small documentary with the drone fishing, uh, about drone fishing. And then uh, after the next day, I want to do, in the end, uh, I could find which one is more attraction. The alive uh, I mean, the not cooked one is more attraction. Not cooked one, there's uh, a little bit big one and then small fishing for the weight, um, about 12 weight I, I could catch it. It's very good. But the other is a uh, cooked crab. 
nothing <laughs> empty that means uh, that means uh, um the the bait got attracted with the smell from the real um real uh fresh or some kind of smell but the cooked one is not attracted I'm not sure. Normally, when we catch the bait, we use sesame, and uh, sesame powder from the windmill, and then and more attraction. So and then I got some bait. I'm expected to try drone fishing soon, but. Uh, maybe today we can try because uh, the wave is a little bit high and about uh, no wind. Uh, if no wind, uh, we can try the um, drone fishing. Uh, what 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 spot? One spot. Now I talk about drone fishing. I check out uh, my composition with the smoking. Speaking and I a little bit uh, uh, murmuring, murmuring. Uh, after then, I check out uh, this uh, with AI. AI gives a clear sentence, paragraph, and structure about my talking. AI can understand what I'm talking. Some thing a little weird, but it's okay. And then the, normally, yeah, I good report about the proofreading. This is uh, my way to improve my speaking skill. I check out uh, my grammar and then uh, good structure of uh, paragraph, sentence, and using good words. Um, this is a very unique way. So I would like to recommend my language family who do online language exchange with me. And then this is a good way to improve it using voice typing to improve the speaking skill and also saving time to write the speaking. Voice typing is uh, two times better than, or maybe three times faster than when we write. Unique. Okay, here you go. I'll try to find the picture. With with test. Voila. ChatGPT gives uh, about uh, my uh, voice typing and good summary. I talk a lot, but the, the summary is very short. Not sure what it says. Then I'm past. I can read it one more time. Today, I want to talk about drone fishing. It's a very unique method where a drone is used to carry the sinker with a baited line out into the ocean. Baited line is very good. I just line with the bait, and then the baited line is very simple out into the ocean. Reaching distance of uh, about 200 to 300 meters so with a with just a click of button, oh, with just a click of button. I talk about it, but my expression is uh, when I click button, and then with a, just a click of a button, the drone releases the line, <clears throat> allowing it to sink into the water. This sentence is make it longer. I made uh, maybe three sentences, but the uh, chat GPT give one sentence with so three sentences. Anglers can then uh, wait patiently until they feel a uh, bite. I didn't say this sentence, but uh, normally it's a process about fishing. 
uh, uh, casting, weighting, or if the angler do the lure fishing, then the angler can slowly and willing to uh, attract the fishy, um, fishy got caught, bite, bit. Anglers can then wait patiently until they feel a bite. Once a fish is hooked, the angler can start reeling it. In. Okay. Drone fishing offers the advantage of reaching far beyond the distant limitation of traditional fishing methods, such as casting with a fishing line, which typically maxes out around six to 70 meters. This opens up the possibility of catching larger fish. Okay. Drone fishing offers. This sentence is also good. It's quite a long sentence. I didn't say this thing, but uh, ChatGPT in me the sentence with uh, summarized a lot. Drone fishing offer uh, the advantage of reaching far beyond the distance limitation of traditional fishing method, such as casting with a fishing line, which typically maxes out around six to seventy meters. Mm. Okay, it's good. Recently, one of my club members and I tested out drone fishing to the show. We needed bait. I tried the casting bait using bait cans and a net. By replacing bait in the cans, and then we could attract small fish, which we then used for beach fishing. Additionally, I experimented with two types of the crab as bait, one cooked and the one not. After observing which he attracted, Directed more fishing, I found that the uncooked crab was more effective. This is good. I also want to mention the process of voicing and typing as a tool for improving speaking skills. By transcribing and reviewing my spoken words, I can analyze my grammar, sentence structure, and the vocabulary usage. This method has been proven effective for me in improving my communication skills. In summary, Drone fishing offer a unique and efficient way to fish. I didn't say in summary, but the chat typically like this pattern. When talk, 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 and then in summary, in conclusion, and the end. And drone fishing offers a unique and an efficient way to fish, allowing anglers to reach a greater distance and potentially catch larger fish. Yes, reasonable. Additionally, utilizing voice typing can be a valuable tool for language learners looking to improve their speaking skills. I think it's uh, this story is uh, totally different. But and then uh, the ChatGPT large language model based on their own uh, provided uh, content. So and then uh, whether it harmonized or not. Just give a summarize, summarize, whatever. And then the end. So I can review about this. Uh, I can uh, review about this again. Then what let the chat GPT again uh, it will post that. After I talk about my voice typing, my diary about drone fishing, and I talk about drone fishing, and this time I speak again and again. I use some words again, again, and then I didn't say about clearly. Just I gave distracted information a little bit. But after proof reading, I when I read it, uh, when I read it, the sentence or uh, sentence is good from the ChatGPT, <clears throat> and then um, uh, the reporting about proof reading is uh, unique, and then I can uh, learn about uh, good expressions and sentence and paragraph and. Uh, from the proof led contents. This is unique. So, and then I talk about uh, voice typing as a, a tool to improve speaking skills. And then uh, it also summarized well. And I think 
um, the pattern of proof red one is a simple sentence or phrase sentence, compound sentence. There are many kind of sentence. And also, well made in grammar. In grammar. Uh, so, and then um, no mistakes in grammar. When I use some expression, I little bit uh, mistakes a lot. I have mistakes a lot in grammar. But after proof letter, the given content, given story is a little bit perfect uh, in grammar. So, and then um, this is very unique. And then uh, I can use a better one. It's summarized. After I did the voice voice typing, voice diary, I use I remember what I told. So I know about what I use some expression and words and sentence. And then reading with the subtitle in Vietnamese, I can study more about build vocabulary better. Because this was from myself. And then and I can remember easily. Then and I can familiar with that vocabulary. It's better. Now I talked again, blah 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 blah. Then and um uh I check out probably the, again about summary of uh, summary about uh, contents uh, by ChatGPT by AI. I think um, ChatGPT sometimes uh, uh, some contents made shorter. Sometimes uh, some contents make longer. <laughs> it's, it's unique. I don't know why. After discussing voice typing in my diary entry, I transitioned to talking about drone fishing. However, upon reflection, I realized that my explanation was a bit scattered and lacked clarity. It's important for me to provide more cohesive information, ensuring that I cover all the key points. When I review my entries, I look for sentences or phrases that are well-crafted, ensuring that my grammar is correct. While I may make mistakes in expressions, the overall contents should be grammar grammatically sound. Um, this method of reviewing my entries allows me to learn new expressions, improve my sentence structure, and refine my paragraph organization. Voice typing has proven to be a valuable tool for improving my speaking skills. By transcribing and reviewing my spoken word, I can identify errors for improvement and track my progress over time. Additionally, summarizing my thoughts have me solidifies my understanding of the topic. I strive to use a variety of sentence uh, structures, including simple, compound, and complex sentence to keep my writing engaging and coherent. After completing voice typing, I often remember uh, the expressions and uh, sentences I use. This reinforces my vocabulary and helps me recall words more easily. By reading along with subtitles in Vietnamese, I further enhance my vocabulary and the language skill. This process allows me to continuously improve and refine my speaking ability. In summary, reviewing my entry helped me ensure clarity and coherence in my writing. Despite occasional mistakes in expression, the overall grammar should be correct. Utilizing voice typing and reviewing entry with AI assistant is in uh, improving my language skill and vocabulary. Very good.
I so you said in fact it will go also. Uh yeah. In terms of what I told, then then the reported one is very good and then that is good and content is good, some are good, and this is from other respects, and then wow. Very good. <laughs>